And so, on June the 18th, 1975, the great trek began. Families who had somehow saved their homes from drought and earlier moves dismantled them. Precious possessions were packed and stowed away for a journey that would take them from everything they had ever known and into a future far removed at which they could only guess. Infants and invalids were carried onto waiting lorries. Papers were checked as whole families moved together. The entire nation's transport resources had been mobilized and others borrowed from abroad. 16 landing strips had been built for 24 huge transport planes, while over 600 lorries took on the rest. In lorry after lorry, covering hundreds of miles, the new farmers moved south. Within days, the first arrivals reached Gordimwari, and local people turned out by the score to greet and welcome them to a new life far removed from the old. Even the mud and rain which greeted them also must have seemed a godsend after the horrors of drought. Neat rows of tents stood ready and waiting as temporary accommodation for those whose houses had been destroyed back in the north. While those who had saved theirs set to quickly rebuilding them in the new settlement. <laughs> Meanwhile, the future fishermen were also on the move, southwards and east to their new homes along the coast. 